You heartless bastard. I'm sorry. You do it because you hate babies or purely to spite me. Because Just if it's the latter, well, I don't know to what to do. you. I'm completely out of ideas. I can't think of a single thing that might improve the experience for me. I'm not even going to try. I'm out. I'm out. <laughs> no. Hey guys, no. what is up? It's Wolf, your one and only, coming at you guys with another video. And this one is called The Stanley Parable. I wanted to play this one before I started the Dr. Langengoff, the Tiger, and the Terribly Cursed Emerald, but. I had that one first before I could play this one. So I was like, nah, before I figured it out at which one came first. And I was just like, never mind. I'm just going to start playing this one first. So without further ado, we're going to get in the game. Hope you guys enjoy and hoping this loading screen is going to take forever. Oh, it didn't. So this didn't is have to cut out. This is story of a man named Stanley. Stanley? Stanley worked for a company in a big building where he was employee number 427. Number 427. Employee number That's a lot of employees. His job was simple. He sat at his desk in room 427 and he pushed buttons on the keyboard. It's like the most Orders boring job ever. But how much does Stanley get paid for push, that? How long to That's push, the mystery. And in what order? This is what employee 427 did every day every month of every year. Oh dear and God. others might have considered it soul rending, Stanley relished every moment that the orders came in. As though he had yeah, but every day? For this job. Jeez. And Stanley was happy. Stanley had better be getting banked and as soon as he retires. Day, something very peculiar happened. Oh. Something that would forever change Stanley. What could it be? Something what changed? Something he would never quite forget. Oh. He had been at his desk for nearly an hour when he realized that not one single order Wait. had arrived on the monitor for him. It to took follow. him an hour no to figure that out. Up to give him instructions, call a meeting, or even say hi. Never in all his years at the company had this. Oh, poor Stanley. This complete hi, isolation. Stanley. I said hi. Something Screw is those very people. clearly wrong. Shocked, frozen solid, Stanley found himself unable to move for the longest time. Huh? But as he came to his wits and regained his senses, he got up from his desk and stepped out of his office. All right. I don't think I should go outside just because, you know, there's a reason why I'm in here. You know? But Stanley simply couldn't handle the pressure. Oh, I he could close the door? Decision. What if a crucial outcome fell under his responsibility? He had never been trained for that. No. This couldn't go any way except badly. The thing to do now, Stanley thought to himself, is to wait. Oh. Nothing will hurt me. Hmm? Nothing will break me. In here, I can be happy forever. Oh, that's kind of like the saddest thought ever. Stanley waited. Hours passed. Then days. Where's the clock? Had years gone by? He no longer had the ability to tell. But the one thing he knew for sure, beyond any doubt, was that if he waited long enough, the answers would come. Really? And eventually, someday, they would arrive. Soon. Wait. Very soon now, this will end. He will be spoken to. He will be told what to do. Now it's just a little bit closer. Now it's even closer. Okay. Here it comes. Really, motherfucker? Really? Don't tell me you just restarted the game. Oh my god. <laughs> Are you serious? You restarted the game. You're, you're kidding me, right? <sighs> well, guys, let's go on an adventure. All right, we, we resume on. Can I open these doors? All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. The computer's no on. No matter how hard Stanley looked, he couldn't find a trace of his co-workers. Ah, uh, well, there was a computer on, so I turned it off. Can't open that door. Can't open that one. Can't open this one. Let's turn that one off. Oh, wait. Input. 
input received? I, I, I have no idea what that is. But I'm gonna keep going. Be. All I got to say is it'll be creepy as hell just to spend a night in this creepy abandoned place. Be the last worker inside of the game. <gasps> Who the hell wasted coffee on my poor carpet? <laughs> you bastards. Do you know how long it takes to get coffee stains out of a freaking rug? How? <laughs> how could you? <laughs> bastards, I'm gonna find a bastard who did this. Oh, I just missed the door. Can I open it? Nope. When Stanley oh. came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. I entered the door on my right. This was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. Uh, actually, no. I did it because I am awesome. And that is creepy as hell. I tried to get into that creepy door. What is wrong with me? Alright. Wow. Yes. This room. What a beautiful room. What a gorgeous, gorgeous room. Yes. Thank goodness so Stanley beautiful. had taken this detour on his way to the meeting room. Life without having experienced this room I can't was sit now in a chair. too horrible even to consider. Uh, I'm just gonna keep moving. But eager to uh -huh. get back to business, I didn't Stanley follow your orders. Okay. Door on his left. Did you wait? Did you just reverse psychology me and make me get out of that room? You bastard! So I entered the door that is straight ahead. Okay, I will listen to that order. Stanley was so bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't five years ago. Hey, hey, chill, okay? This is actually my first time on a job and moving around. I don't know where I am, and I'm getting lost. Do not lie. If you're... <laughs> if you are lying, right now, stop. Words. 2015. Oh, I don't have a key card. Sad face. Oh, look. Wait. Do not jump from the cargo lift while it's in motion. You don't tell me what to do. I do what I want. Look, Stanley, I think perhaps we. But in his eagerness to prove that Oops. he is in control of the story and no one gets to tell him what um. to do, Stanley leapt from the platform and plunged to his death. Good job, Stanley. Everyone thinks you are very powerful. My, my hands are in the air. I, I, I'm sorry. Wait, what? Whoa. Papers? All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Um, okay. There's a lot of paper everywhere. I think I fucked up a little wait the Was I just seeing things? Or was there something on that handle? I I, I must be seeing things. <laughs> Clearly. <gasps> you bastards, you put the paper inside the cup. Really? <laughs> That's just anarchy. Alright. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. I went back to the door on the right just to see where my body is. way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. The lounge was sublime, a work of art. I know. What was it about this magnificent room that called so deeply and so personally to Stanley? Its grace, its subtle charm. No, Stanley knew it was something deeper, deeper, something darker. Oh, yeah. Oh, wait. That's not what you said the first time. Um, sir, what are you doing? I thought this yes. was part of the story. Really, really worth it being here in the room. A room so utterly captivating that even though all your co workers have mysteriously vanished, here you sit looking at these chairs and some paintings. Really worth it. Yeah, because it's better without all my co workers, you know? Because I am awesome. But eager to get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. So I went straight again. Okay. 
I'm obeying orders like a boss. Stanley was so bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't fired years ago. Okay, this time I'm gonna stay on the left. Look, Stanley, I think perhaps we've gotten off on the wrong foot here. I'm not your enemy, really, I'm not. I realize that investing your trust in someone else can be difficult, but the fact is that the story has been about nothing but you all this time. And I'm gonna jump off the lift again. Is someone you've been neglecting? So that didn't work out how I thought. Okay, never mind. Um, it seems like it worked out. Um, all of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Um, guys, what did? I think jumping from a lift is probably something I shouldn't have done. <laughs> Stanley went around touching every little thing in the office, but it didn't make a single difference, nor did it advance the story in any way. Da, 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 da. This door, this door. Welcome to the whiteboard, Andy. Wait, isn't this the end of the game? God damn it. Guess it's not. All right, time to go back. Stanley came to a set of two open doors. He entered the door on his left. I entered the door on my right again. This was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, so, just to admire it. I'm curious. Standing now in this incredible room, Stanley for the first, but eager to get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. So, is this, like, the deaf one? Like, if I keep Stanley killing myself, it's something changed. Following directions, it's incredible he wasn't fired years ago. Look, so, Stanley, I think perhaps we've got let's do this one more time. I know I'm powerful. I know I'm amazing. Let's do this again. How wonderful! Stanley was alone. Finally, this is great. He thought to himself, "This is what I've wanted." Okay, all along. everything's changing. I got what I wanted. Interesting. All right. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. So the right again. This was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly. It's weird well. because Perhaps every time I go through, it changes more and more. First, just to admire it. Stanley felt lightheaded, butterflies in his stomach, but eager to get back to business. Stanley took the first open door on his left. So forward again. Okay. I am clearly doing this Stanley right. Stanley was so bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't fired years ago. It's death. What happens Good from here? Job, Stanley. Like, it may repeat over and over again, the ending, but it's changing as, as I go through. Even now, Stanley's office was a distant memory. What did it look See? like? There was a computer, perhaps, and a painting. Was it a painting or a photo? He could no longer recall. This is so weird. When Stanley came to so the right again. Open this was not the correct way to the meeting. It's room, clearly the right Stanley way. Because well. I am doing this Perhaps right. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. The lounge was grand, majestic. Perhaps, but eager to get back to business. Stanley took the first open door on his left. First open door straight. Okay. Stanley was so bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't fired years ago. One more time. But no. Okay. Stanley knew the office layout like the back of his hand. It was only a matter of time before he found the others, wherever they were. Just a matter of time. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee. It has to be first, into it. Just to admire it. Because you just can't keep making up new dialogue. And here and... it was. The lounge. What a room, Stanley thought to himself. But eager to get back to the Like business, every time Stanley took the, the narration changes as you go left. through those rooms. That's the weird part. Stanley was so bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't fired. So one more time. But in his I don't know. Okay, let's just get, keep going. Just a step through this door, Stanley thought to himself, that's all I need. If See? I make it through this door, it just keeps saying different all. things again and again. I I don't know if it's just 
When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, I went to the one under my right. Not the correct way okay, this time I'm not going to do the same thing. Okay. Well. I'm going to try and jump on that uh, by the employee little lift first, right there. Just to admire it. It was okay. Okay. This is getting me more curious and curious now that he says that. But eager to get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his We're left. gonna figure this out. Cause this is like the weirdest crap Stanley ever. Was so bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't five years ago. No, I wanna get on this lift, and when they lift me over Look, Stanley, I think perhaps we've got jump down on this foot here. I'm not your enemy, really, I'm not. I realize that investing in your trust in someone so, else can be come difficult, on, go over the rail. but the fact is that the story has been about nothing but you all this time. All right, There's someone here you go, guys. Neglecting Stanley. Someone... What? Really? I was in the middle of something. Do you have zero consideration for others? Are you that no. convinced that I want something bad to happen to you? Why, I don't know how to convince you of this, but I really do want to help you, to show you something beautiful. No. Look, let me prove it. Let me prove that I'm on your side. Give me a chance. No. I think I killed our loop, sadly. But you guys can try it out for yourselves and see what you get from that. <laughs> but this is weird, mysterious room. Now listen carefully, this is important. Stanley walked through the red door. Stanley walked through the blue door. Okay. Aha. Perhaps you misunderstood. Stanley walked through the red door. Stanley walked through the blue door. I still don't think we're communicating <laughs> properly. Stanley uh -oh. walked through the red door. Are you getting angry at me? So, the blue door. All right, fine. Go ahead, Stanley. You want to know so badly what's out there? You want to find out what lies at the end of this road you've chosen? Well, don't let me stop you. You so, see? What the fuck? There's nothing here. What the hell? I even finished building this section of the map because you were never supposed to be here in the first place. Broken rooms, exposed developer textures. Is this what I'm, you had wanted? I'm sorry. Was it worth ruining the entire story I had written out specifically for you? Yes. Do you yes, it was I worth it. It was so worth it. Because I did. And in the end, it was all for nothing. Because this is what you wanted to see. Help me here, Stanley. Help elucidate these strange and unknowable desires of yours. What Never! What would have made this game better? What did you want to see? Vehicles? Skill trees? Yeah, skill trees. Work with me. You give me absolutely nothing so far. Tell you what. Let me take a stab in the dark at a new design, and you can give me some feedback. Please don't stab me. There we go. A third option. This already feels leaps ahead of where we were before. Go ahead, Stanley. Take it for a spin. So the right again. Okay, oh. I'm going to stop you there. Now, tell me about your experience with this new version. Would you say that the game benefited from allowing you more choices? Feel free to be honest. I'm looking for some real critical feedback here. I always choose five. Aha! You see, I knew I was onto something. Where do these flashes of inspiration come from? How did I know the game needed a third door? Door? Well, it's it always needs a third door. A calling in your gut. I really couldn't say where the idea came from, except that I, I felt it in my soul. You did? You can't mm. use that, Stanley. Don't even try. Oh. Here, based on the data from your previous playthrough, I've compiled a new version. And to be perfectly candid, I think I've knocked it out of the park with this one. A new version? A <gasps> Sweet, put me in it. <laughs> World why? Oh, God. Well, he really changed that up. I'm gonna go middle. God damn it. Now, would you say that competitive leaderboard helped you feel motivated to keep walking through doors? Again, honest answers, please. Do, 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 do. Hey, I nearly forgot. I've got a prototype of a new game I've been working on, and now would be a lovely opportunity to give it some playtesting. <laughs> you wouldn't mind taking a look at it, would you? No, Perfect. not really. Not really. Boot it up. This is getting fun. In what this game, the baby fuck? Baby crawls left towards danger. You click the button to move him back to the right, and if he reaches the fire, you fail. 
It's a very meaningful game. Um. All about the desperation and tedium of endlessly confronting the demands of family life. Um. They think the art world will really take notice. But of course, the message of the game only becomes clear once you've been playing it for about four hours. So why don't you give it four hours of play to make sure it's effective? Uh, Be sure uh, to keep notes on your experience. Never. I, I I don't approve of killing kids, but you heartless bastard. I'm sorry. You do it because you hate babies or purely to spite me. Because Just if it's the latter, well, kind of despite you. I'm completely out of ideas. I can't think of a single thing that might improve the experience for me. I'm not even going to try. I'm out. I'm out. <laughs> no. It's no. over. No. Thank you for playing. <laughs> don't leave input me. input was extremely valuable. Don't oh, leave hey, me. Hey, since my game was so awful, why don't we play someone else's game? Just to ease the pain. Let's see. What do we have here? I'm sorry. <laughs> Can we go back to the game? I'm oh, sorry. Seems like it'll work. Let's give it a shot. What 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 game did you just load up, you bastard? Tell me. What did you just load up? Is this loading simulator 2? Oh. Oh, Minecraft. Well, Stanley, Great. is any better? At last, the one thing you've always desired, a game I had absolutely nothing to do with. But is it enough? <laughs> Tell me that, Stan. <laughs> Will it ever be enough? Well, I'll say this. Well, I'm done making things for you. It's From a free account, on, so only basically. To a greater artistic purpose. Watch this, Stanley. I'm going to build a house. Where is it? It's like that most. We'll go here. No, here. And then... Let's see his building skills. Let's see, what does it need? I, uh, yes, of course. And just to finish it all off, yes. Oh, damn it. It's complete. I, I wanted to get in it to it before you did. Stanley. Look at it. Gaze upon my work of art and feel ashamed at your own inadequacy. That sucks. Ah, but you've only seen it from the outside. You've only gotten half the experience. Please, Wait, what? step inside and make yourself comfortable. Wait, isn't it grand? Yes. Isn't it perfect? That's it could magnificent. Only be better if... Wait, that's it. We must rebuild it out of diamond. Diamond Wait. everything. Do you have yes, diamonds? Yes, yes. Come along, Stanley. We have to go mining. Wait. God damn it, when did I start playing Minecraft? Well, it's a free account, so I cannot get playing. It's all free. All right, let's go down here into this dark hole where creepers oh live. It looks like it's going to get a bit dark. Have you brought a light? Nope. I don't think so. That's coal. I found coal if that's what you're looking for. What is light? Oh, God. Oh, no, 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 Going no, deeper no. and deeper. This is far more open-ended than I had in mind. I'm looking for something more narrow and linear. Something that makes you feel utterly irrelevant. This won't do at all. One out of five. Even the diamonds couldn't save this one. Okay, new <laughs> game. Oh, God. Hands in the air. I don't even know what was about to kill me. <laughs> all right, so he's loading up a new game. Let's see what new game he puts in. Oh dear God! This better not be what I think it is. <laughs> yes, you bastard! I don't even know what this game is, but I love it. Fucking portal! You trapped in a glass box with no way out, listening to me talk. Oh, it's inspired. I couldn't have done it any better oh. myself. What is this game even supposed to be? I can't figure it out. Okay, now I'm curious. It belongs in a fucking toilet. Do I at least get the portal gun, sir? This goes in the toilet. This this piece goes in 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 the toilet. God damn it! This piece goes. God darn it! Toilet. Toilet. Um. I think I broke something. 
the hell? That also goes in the toilet. Okay, can you, can you like let me out there? I don't know. He he won't let me out. I what the fuck? Okay, well I'm out. So let's go on continuing our adventure. What game do you have lined up for me? It's a puzzle. Critical thinking, Stanley. Your forte. Genius. There. I don't want to get rid of the cube, you bastard. Fine. Fine, fine, fine. Fine, you can have my cube. No, actually, you know what? I think that's plenty. You fucking I bastard, really you don't own this world. Stumble through any more of these games. I did it. <laughs> I don't know where I am, but I did it. And it's really dark. I think I fell off the map. Um, I don't know what I did, but I believe I broke the game. And it's very dark. Um, Narrator, did you give up on me? Oh look, light. Are we going back on the story? Narrator? Narrator! Are you still with me? No? <laughs> um... I made some weird choices in my life, but shit. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I think I should have probably, um... Listen to the narrator. Okay, oh, well, I, I, I'm sorry. I wonder what he found. If what he wanted was to be the leading man in his own story, well, perhaps he's gotten it. Down in wherever he is right now. Um. I wonder if he's happy with his choice. Yeah, I, He's learned I, I, the heavy cost that comes with it. He'll understand soon what I was trying to tell him. He needs me. Someone who will wrap everything up at the end to make sense out of the chaos and the fear and the confusion. That's who I am. That is what I mean to this world. Oh, yes. Yes, I'll be back. There's no other way. I'm sorry. Once this ends, <laughs> after it all comes to a close, then I'll be back. There needs the end to be, be more. Here soon. Very soon. Very soon. I can wait. Yes, you can. I know. You got no time in the world just like me. The end is never the end. The end is loading. Hmm. So. <laughs> well. <laughs> that was my ending. So. I'm so curious about the death one. So. You guys can go do that one. And you let me know if you've never seen that ending before. But, with that said, when you guys play the game, put down in the description. I mean, put down, put down in the description. Like, you control that one. <laughs> when you guys play the game, put down what ending you got in the comments on your first try. Because I would love to see what, sh what you guys got. So, until then, I'll see you guys next time. Hope you guys enjoyed. How dare you restart the game without my permission? Didn't I disobey you? You can't just start over like that.
Whoa, 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 Mr. Duck, no, turn, turn, turn around, turn the fuck back around, whoa, let me off this ride, Mr. Duck is scaring me, Mr. 